Hello everybody, my name is Heather and welcome back to my channel. Um, I am in the middle of filming a couple of festive videos, so that's why there's this like Halloween background happening right here. Um, and I'm in my costume because it's fun, so yeah. So hopefully I'll get this video up on my channel before Halloween so I don't look like a crazy person posting a festive video after Halloween. Um, cause nothing about this video is Halloween related. <laughs> and I believe this is like my third video in a row up on this channel. So I hope that's not bothering anybody. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to, uh, just trying to catch up a little bit. So this, as you can tell by the title, is my project pan, my burn through project pan collab update. So I have six products to kind of update you on. So let's just get into it. The first one is my Benefit the Professional Face Primer. I use it all up. It's completely empty. So one down. The next is my Too Faced Shadow Insurance eyeshadow primer and this is tough to show you guys um, I'll definitely do a close-up um, I, I mean I use it every time I do my eyeshadow so I don't really know I, I I'm sure there is a difference but when it's in a tube I feel like I have trouble really knowing how much is left the next one is my Urban Decay 24 7 concealer pencil I have sharpened it a couple of times. I didn't actually mark it on a piece of paper or anything, but I mean, I'll do a compare and contrast to the first um, close-up I did in the intro. Um, it's gotten to the point here. Let me take the little bottom off. So it's really tiny. Um, it's gotten to the point where I can barely sharpen it anymore. Um, I can't even really like hold on to it very well when I'm trying to twist it. So I don't know if I'll be able to use every single bit of this, to be perfectly honest. I, if you have a trick on how to sharpen like a little nubbin of a, a product, um, please let me know because at this point, um, it's, I mean, it's still kind of sharpened. I could still get to it. I could still use it. Um, but I don't know like once it flattens out I'll probably just get a concealer brush and like just start digging into it and see how much I can get out I'll try and sharpen it but I just don't know how much more I can sharpen it um I definitely use it to sharpen up my brows when I'm doing my brows sometimes like today I did sometimes I use it under my eyes um, but as I said it's a very dry formula it's not very good for under eyes next is my Mirness glossy kiss I will definitely do a close-up of this because um it's like, it looks like it might be gone, but it's not. There's still product inside. So what I do is I've been taking this little um, lip brush and just pretty much digging into the hole that is in here um, and trying to get what I can from it. I'm not wearing it today, um, but I have been using it for the play that I'm in. I'm in Pride and Prejudice. It's just a really simple, like, muted pink color so it's fine for um for being on stage it's got color but it's not like in your face and um period inappropriate so next is my true l'oreal true match super blendable blush in uh pressed pre <laughs> precious peach again i'll do a close-up but i have hit pan so yay uh, there's quite a big uh circle of pan in there so that's pretty exciting um, I'm wearing it today it's a really nice just blush color I'm I have other blushes that I really want to use so I am looking forward to using this all up and the last product is my elf high definition powder um so again I'll do a close-up I've said that for like every single product except for the one I went through but anyway so there's not much left although there might be much left I can't totally tell because I don't use very much when I do use it and lately I haven't even been using it all that much like I haven't really needed to because I've started using the Kat Von D Lock It foundation and I don't need to set it I honestly do not need to set that foundation it is so matte it's got such a matte finish and it's so long wearing that I feel like when I set it it's just too much it's like no you don't need to because then I use the powder just for the sake of using it and then I have to do like some sort of setting spray to kind of like make it not look all dry and powdery anymore um, and then I just feel like I'm wearing too much makeup but anyway I'm, I'm just trying to use it up I'm trying to use it up uh, so that's what project pan is for that's why you guys are watching this video so anyway 
that is it for this update uh so one down five to go i'm doing i'm doing okay i'm doing pretty well i think i can definitely get through um most of these by the end of this project now as i said at the beginning um, this is a collab and all of the girls who are included in this collab plus a couple of other girls who have notified me that they've kind of jumped on to this project i will link everyone's um, channels down in the description box for you to check them out and check out their videos and that's what i really like about this collab actually i really like that Anyone who wants to do it can jump into it, even if you don't, I mean, there's like, you know, a month or two, like maybe a month and a half left of this project pan, you can still jump in on it and let us all know that you have, um, because that's what this beauty community is all about. We're very opening and welcoming, and if you want to do it, you can do it without rambling on much more. If you liked this video, please be sure and give it a thumbs up and comment below anything that you want just say hi just say happy halloween anyway subscribe to my channel if you so choose and if you are subscribed or just subscribed i will see you guys in my next video bye